You know, when I was growing up, I always heard the term or the the phrase first comes love, then comes marriage, then comes a baby in a baby carriage. Well, it's true. I'm Robin Wilson, the CEO of Robin Wilson Home. We're a lifestyle brand and I'm an eco-friendly interior designer. I'm a mommy to be. I'm also a newlywed and I'm about to go through a lot of transition. When we learned that we were pregnant, which was in a couple months ago, um, the first question was, would the city be the right place to raise a child? I can't imagine being a kid and being told, okay, I wanna play with the ball. Okay, let's wait till we take a cab to get to the park. You can play for 25 minutes and you can't play in the sand because dogs do what they do in the, in the, in the sand and you can't be a kid. I don't know if I want my child to have that I want my child to be a child and to have a little bit of innocence a little longer if I can. And the problem with the city and the great part of the city is you don't have space, so it encourages you to go out and to hang out and to do cool things and to experience the city. But when you start nesting or wanting to nest because you're pregnant, um, and you know the space you have is again smaller than a garage bay or the size of a garage bay there's not too much nesting you can do so you have to make a choice so we have a backyard we have a groundhog <laughs> we have squirrels we have rabbits from homes to commercial spaces this woman is becoming a design powerhouse We'll meet entrepreneur Robin Wilson tonight as we continue our series, American Dreamers. The hardest thing to realize is, is your own inner sense of vulnerability because sometimes you identify your business as the space that it's in versus your business and the brand that you've built. Eco interior consultant and designer Robin Wilson is a visionary and pioneer who has set the benchmarks for eco-friendly design and has become a leading advocate for clean construction methods. I had a total meltdown the day I realized you know, I worked for 12 years to build a company that was, you know, you're sitting in an office or loft space and you're looking over at your team and, and now we've gone to this virtual thing and there was a moment of, oh my gosh, have I failed because I've ratcheted back our operational expenses. And, um, you know, that's where we are. It's, it's, a, it's a change and it's a, it's a good change, but it's certainly taking some getting used to um, not going to the city every day. I love the city, but I have to be realistic. I'm building a family, I've made a transition, and that means the city is in my rearview mirror. It's time to move to the suburbs. It's gonna be with great joy that I go out and do some shopping. Soho, Tribeca, fun, fun, fun. It's time to get the crib. 